this whistle stop. And what it does is whistle stops designed to notify users when they reach a certain location, such as a local train station, office or restaurant. Um, the app uses GPS and Wi-Fi to obtain the user's position, and it's really great for people who are traveling by train. You know, you, you get on the train, you fall half asleep and you miss your stop. Or you're watching a movie and you have to look out the window every five minutes to make sure you don't miss your stop. Uh, Whistle stop will stop your music or your video and tell you to get off the train, basically. Uh, so this is your starting screen, and obviously we're in on the simulator because it's easy to make a video. And, and this is kind of useful. This is help, is available on all screens, just click the ring. So let's just click here, that disappears. But if you click any screen, you see one of these rings, you click it and it tells you exactly what each bits and pieces do. Uh, here's settings, there's the ring again, help ring again, shows you what it does. Let's go back. So, as I said, I'm using a simulator and so let's put a location in here. So this is Apple headquarters and we can do a very, very simple demo. Whoops, we didn't want to put that in there. Um, so, I want to know basically when I arrive at Mariani Avenue. So I'm going to drop a pin here. So we've dropped a pin there. Now when we've dropped a pin, we've got two choices. We could delete it. Big deal, not very interesting. Or let's drop it again. Or we can configure it with the I on the right hand side. Now this is the configure. This tells you what the pin's going to do. Probably the most important thing is this bit here. This shows you the, the speech that it's going to say, and you can you can test that by just clicking. Arriving at location zero. Notice it says arriving at location zero. That's because the Bose is on. Let's just turn it off and try that again. Location zero. And it's also it's going to say on enter, so we can say on enter, or on exit, or on both. Let's do it on enter. Um, we can also choose some presets. Bus station. Church. So if you can't be bothered to type in. Gallery. And so on and so on. We can also choose days of the week for the pin. So that's, if we do this, it's only going to work on a Monday. Let's, let's turn them all back on now. And we can choose the time of the day that the pin's active. And this goes all the way to the morning. And this is the stop time. It can be any time you like. And we can also choose the range of the pin. Let's make it a little bit smaller to start off with. Now if we go back, you notice the pin has changed to 20 meters. And we're just, if we look at this, this is Mariani Avenue. So let's go over here. Um, let's change this to Mary Annie Aven You. Okay. Now, if we get this to speak. Arriving at Mariani Avenue. Sometimes pronunciation in the um, speech synthesizer is not so good. So just. Change the spelling a little bit, or put a space in between two words. Arriving at Mariani Avenue. Okay, so that's pretty good. So we've got this pin here. Um, let's just tap this. Now, we know that we're, let's just zoom out a little bit. We're there. So use the simulator again. And we're going to simulate City Bicycle ride, ride, which starts at the company store and goes through here. So uh, we just press 4, and you can see that it's simulating somebody on a bicycle. Arriving at Mariani Avenue.
a few more online when it can think of some cool ones to do. Hey, thanks for listening.